Good morning, everybody. I am up and out of bed, and we are out of the house bright and early this morning. I have a doctor's appointment to get my surgery checked out on my foot this morning. So it is raining here, finally, in Southern California. Most people would say it's a gloomy day, but I love the rain. So I'm enjoying this. It's not raining hard enough for me though. I would like it to pour and thunder and lightning, but we can wait till that for that till we get home. But uh, this is what it looks like on the roads here in California when it rains. Nobody knows how to drive in the rain. Yeah, nobody knows how to drive in the rain out here. And plus, it rains so little that the oils come up in the roads when it does rain. So you got the people that drive extremely slow, and then you got the people that drive very fast and hit the oil spills and get in accidents. So it's really crazy in California when it does rain. But we need the rain so bad that I'm not complaining. So how are you this morning, honey? Oh, not bad considering. Yeah, did you sleep okay? I slept okay. Yeah. So we can get the Christmas decorations out when we get home. Well, you can because I can't help. <laughs> Sounds like a good thing to do, considering we can't do anything outside. Yeah. We're going to have a nice day. Maybe we can even, I don't know how you feel about maybe watching a movie or two. Possible. Since it's waning. Yeah. And you can't hang up the Christmas lights outside in the nope. rain. Probably could, but I'm not going to. <laughs> You have to do it some at some point, baby. We gotta have our Christmas decorations up. I know, dear. <laughs> it can, hey, you call. Oh, see, see, people are putting on their brakes for absolutely no reason. Absolutely <laughs> no reason. He called me a deer, and I have my reindeer antlers on, so I'm a deer. Yes, dear. <laughs> Love you, honey. Love you too, dear. Pretty. Ready. These are stuck together. Yeah, there we go. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so how's it look? It looks gnarly. Gnarly? Gnarly. How's it feel? Well, it hurts if I move my toes. Okay, put your feet together. I want to see how much swollen that is. I would say that's pretty swollen. Yeah. If I move my toes, it hurts. Yeah, well, don't move your toes then. I can bend them this way, but if I go <laughs> pull them out, it hurts. Well, it's, it's a ligament you've worked on that to attach to your toes, so don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> so we just stopped at a Denny's so we can get something to eat because I took my meds this morning. I haven't eaten anything and it's going on 11, well it's 11.15 right now. And I can't go without eating after I take my meds, so. And it's closed because they are out of power because we have a little bit of rain. Well, I think there was an accident is what I think and that's what we're seeing. Oh, because of the Some, fire truck yeah, and ambulance. Maybe somebody took out a power line. Oh, okay. So, but, uh, you know, it actually took us quite a while to get to this Denny's because it was hard to get to because uh, th there was only one way to get into this Denny's and it wasn't the way we were coming. So we had to do an complete circle, sit through some overly long lights and um, uh, wait for a um, ambulance and a fire truck and we get into the Denny's and we're told eh, there's no power. <laughs> so we're gonna go and try and find Someplace else to eat because I'm hungry. Hungry, hungry. I see, I see police cars going by still. Yeah. Well, let's go see if we can get a picture of a accident or something. Okay. Okay, so this is where the fire truck and the one of the cop cars is at. And they're looking at, it looks like a fire and a light. I don't know. I don't know. It's confusing. I, I don't really see much. No. Nope. But whatever it was, it was causing Denny's to have no power. So, find me food. 
Yes, dear. So we finally found a Denny's that's open right around the corner from our house. <laughs> but they serve breakfast all day, so I'm getting my breakfast. Yay! And then we're gonna go home and Kevin's gotta go pick up some stuff for mom because she doesn't like to go out in the rain and she needs some stuff. And then maybe, hopefully, when Kevin gets home, we can cuddle up on the couch and watch some movies. Maybe, huh? Maybe? Maybe. Yay! Did you get your drink? Yes, you got me my drink. You got your antlers? Yes, you got, got me your my pillow. Drink. Yes, you got me my pillow. Got your medication. Got my medication. Got your blankie. Got my blankie. Your door's open so you can listen to the rainfall. My door's open so I can listen to the rainfall. Got my remote. Got your remote. Got my my iPod. Got my phone. Got my my tablet. I'm just missing one thing. What's that? My ice pack. Okay. Now. Is that it? Just because I'm out of work doesn't mean I work for you now. Yes, you do. You're going to be my in-home caregiver. Well, there's no pay in that. Well, you get the luxury of taking care of me. Uh-huh. Boomer, take care of her. Because don't forget, you get tomorrow off. But Thursday, we have to go for another surgery. I get tomorrow off? <laughs> Yeah, but Thursday... I'm so lucky. <laughs> but Thursday, we get to go for another surgery. Another surgery. Yes, and the doctor said I'll be in pain and laid up for at least three days after this surgery. So, okay. for three days, you're going to be my in-home caregiver. Alright, so decide on what movie we're going to watch, because when I get... Mom, her stuff, then I'm not doing anything. Right, well, I'm gonna uvu while you're gone, but before you leave, you have to give me my ice back! <sighs> yes, dear. My foot hurts! I need ice on it! It's about time you get home. Where have you been? Uh. Oh. <laughs> We're just trying to get settled to watch a movie, and we can't get Kevin to sit down. And stop moving around. I wonder why. He just keeps moving and going back and forth to the kitchen. And I'm why sitting with my son. Why is that? Why is that? Why is that, Kevin? Why do you keep moving around? Why can't you just sit down? Oh. You want before I sit down? No. Nope. Anything else? Are you done? What do you mean? I'm not bothering you. Yeah. Freckles, are you bothering Daddy? Are you bothering Daddy? No, because he knows you have food. How about a zombie film? Does it have Daryl Dixon in it? I was just about it? to say, without Daryl Dixon in it. Then it's not worth it. Uh -huh. Sorry. Zombie film's got to have my Daryl Dixon. I think we should try and find another disaster movie. I like disaster movies. Don't ask me why. Because our life's a disaster. <laughs> yes, but we can still laugh about it. Uh -huh. Look at the camera and laugh. <laughs> Dana, isn't it hot in here? Yeah, I, I mean, it looks hot and the way Kevin is dressed, it looks hot. It, the way I'm dressed, it, I look hot. Dana just said I was hot. <laughs> you want to change to team? Do you want to change to team Val now? <laughs> I am freezing cold. That's what we're trying to say. See, I'm freezing. It's hot in here. It's Turn the heat freezing. off. There is no heat on. If I get up and I go look at the heat thermometer thermostat and it's on. I'm going to have to hurt you. What's your thermostat set at? Dana, what's your thermostat set at at your house? Let me go check. I'll be right now. Holy crap, it's hot in my room. 
See, it's hot in her room. It's hot here, too. Cause 73 degrees. You know what it's you know what our thermostat's set at? 69. And that's too hot. 69 and she's too hot. It's hot. It's cold. It's hot. It's freezing. Beep beep. Beep beep. Oh man. I went you over. Who's gonna oh, get bam. who's gonna get hurt here? I was just Me? thinking. <laughs> Tails up, tails up. Beep, beep, fuego. Out of the way, out of the way. Beep, beep. Going down the hill. Go. Clop. Clop. All right. Hello, everybody. Hello, everybody. Is he making fun of me again? I wouldn't do that. Guess what time it is. It's time for, I don't know, it's, uh, shout out. Yeah, that's it. I'm gonna sneeze. Never mind. Our very first shout out, unfortunately, is a very sad shout out. It goes out to Tanya Ray. I'm very sorry, Tanya. Uh, her best friend, Danny, passed away today. Um, December 2nd, 2014, from brain cancer. Um, I wanted to show you my ribbon. Um, can you zoom in, baby? I don't know how we can do this. We'll try. I wanted to zoom in. Um, Tanya, I have a ribbon on my wrist right here. That's a brain cancer ribbon. My cousin Jimmy passed away in 2013 from brain cancer as well. I know what you're going through, sweetheart, and uh... She's, he was a good friend. Yeah. Both of us. Yeah. Hang in there. Stay strong, and uh, if you need to talk, you know how to get a hold of me. Love you, sweetie. We have a lot of shout-outs We do today. have a lot of shout-outs. I just wanted to say we had quite a bit of, of an outpouring of, uh, um, well wishes from everybody from me losing my position um, I, again as we said um, you know I'm very unhappy to have lost the job but I'm certainly not unhappy for not working at this place anymore it, as everybody was saying it's, it's, it's kind of killing me so. to me my, my, the way I've been putting it to everybody it's a blessing in disguise. This job was slowly killing Kevin. He was extremely unhappy there. And as hard as it's going to be financially for us, it's <clears throat> better off. We're going to be better off. He's going to be better off. So um, I didn't touch on everybody here, but I we want to thank everybody for their kindness and, and their thoughts. Prayers. Yeah, more messages than I've seen on a, any single vlog before. It was like uh, nearly a hundred. Yeah, I've heard a lot from a lot of people we uh, we've never heard from before who have obviously been watching but not commenting. So uh, they felt the need to comment, which I, I really appreciate. Thank you very much. So, okay, Megan Magic X, Megan Goss. She's also known as. She is at 21 subs. 21 subs. She wants to get to 30 by Christmas. I know we can do that for her. That's only 9 subs. And we got, what, 23 days to do it in? Mm -hmm. I know we can do that for her, guys. Let's get her to 30 subs. She's got clever videos, too. Oh, she's so... she's Yeah, she's, she's really good. Really into the... Um, um, uh, what do you call it? The... Um, editing part. She puts yeah. together all kinds of crazy stuff. Yeah, she's really, really talented. You guys should definitely go check her out. Charlena Higdon! I've missed you, girl. I kept saying to Kevin, where is she? Why isn't she watching? Where is she? And I even sent some messages. I was hoping you're okay. I'm glad everything's okay. And welcome back. Bobby Holland, you said we wouldn't miss you. I always miss all my people when they're gone. I notice when people are missing. Ask him. I always say to him, 
this one's not responding anymore. Where'd they go? So it's nothing OCD about that. Yeah. <laughs> no, not OCD. I just know when people are there. I know my viewers. So welcome back, Bobby Holland. Teresa Heidi. Welcome to the neighborhood. Pattinson fan, welcome to the neighborhood. And Pattins, Pattinson who? Uh, Pattinson from you know the, uh, the vampire. Yeah, that that's that's what I want to know. That's what I figured. Is it, is it uh, from Twilight? Twilight. Twilight. Is it from Twilight? Let us know. Sweetheart eight one o six seven. Yes. I do think a lobster dinner would probably help me heal quicker. So instead of waiting for my 28 days, which is 12 days away, I think a lobster dinner would probably help me heal a lot quicker. And I think tomorrow would be the perfect day for it. Crimson Fairy. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Welcome to the neighborhood. Swiffer Productions, welcome to the neighborhood. Uh, is that Swifter Productions? Swifter Productions. <laughs> Not the Swiffer that you do the feet. It's Swifter like they're faster. I got cleaner on my mind. Cleaning on my mind. <laughs> Swifter Productions, <clears throat> welcome to the neighborhood and shout out to you. Um... Megan Dalton 233, shout out to you. We just sub to you, and I will check out your vlogs over the next few days. Ciao. Welcome. Oh, I already said welcome to the neighborhood, didn't I? No, I didn't. Welcome to the neighborhood. And she said, would we ever come to Ireland? I would love to go to Ireland. Would you want you to wanna, go to you wanna buy us we're, a trip to Ireland? We're, I'm Irish. <laughs> If you haven't figured that out. I'm a little bit of Irish. She's Polish. Mostly Polish. In case you guys didn't know. Jay Bennett 380. Welcome to the neighborhood. Thea Algier. <laughs> we miss you, lady. Hope everything is going well over there on the other side of the pond. She said we could go and visit her and we have a place to stay. Wow. Yeah. Twice stars, welcome to the neighborhood. ASAP Ginger, welcome to the neighborhood. Wow. Raymond Big Dog, welcome to the neighborhood. The Abyss 92882 says that he would like us to give each other a hug for him. Okay. We can do that. That's for you, The Abyss 92882. Portland Creek Diaries. Thank you so very much for all the kind words today. We just love you and your family. You guys are so very special to us. You really, really are. And welcome to the neighborhood. Post some more blog. <laughs> okay, and then our last vlog goes out to a new subscriber to us. His name is Ross Wall. Um, first of all, welcome to the neighborhood and thank you for your kindness and your generosity. And he had suggested something that... He, he had suggested something that we had not considered and um, but we are considering now. It, it wouldn't have been something we had ever, ever have thought of but he uh, said that um, uh, if we had a GoFundMe account that he would uh, put money into it. Um, I would say I don't think things are that bad yet. What do you think? Well, you know, and with Christmas being here and, you know. But, uh, you know, maybe i would just put it out to you. If uh, we put the, a GoFundMe account together, is that something... Uh, is that so? Is, is that, that something, something that you'd, uh, yeah? I, I mean, I, f I know I feel kind of funny about it. Yeah, is but, it um, you know? Anyway, it's time for me.
neighborhood, neighborhood community. community credit roll. Credit roll. And ah, we gotta, mojo. We gotta make it in a mojo. People keep Say getting hi. mojo and Say boomer kind of mojo. mixed up from far away. Boomer's the fat one. Yeah. <laughs> and the hairy one. Yeah. Mojo short hair. Mojo doesn't like to be helped, but I wanted everyone to see Megan. And everybody got to see Megan. Yeah. Yeah. She likes to attack the cat. <laughs>